What's up guys, welcome to another video from Darklord. Uh, this video today, or the gameplay that you're going to be seeing on screen, is just a random team deathmatch that I played with um, a few of the new crew members that joined. Don't really know these guys, they're called, they both have names like TCA something, I don't really know. But you know, they're cool dudes and they were uh, playing with me and I did pretty good in this game so I thought I'll use it as a gameplay. But while you guys are watching this, I'm actually on holiday. But um, I wanted to get something uploaded, something GTA, because I'm going to be uploading some more Call of Duty videos as well over the time that I'm on holiday. So I don't want people thinking that I've completely forgot about GTA because I am still playing it way more than Call of Duty. And when I get back, expecting a lot more videos of um, uh, GTA as well. But hopefully if this video is up, you guys have seen the uh, little crew match that we did with UTL. I I'm not sure which one I'm doing. We beat them twice. But yeah, they beat us twice as well, but it was just practice. But um. What I actually wanted to talk about today was um, the, well, basically competitive gaming in general. Because, as you guys probably know, if you've been following me for a long time, I'm all about the competitive scene of like all Rockstar games that I've played. I don't really care about you know anything else other than trying to be the best at the game. I know that sounds sort of weird. I didn't. That wasn't my intentions when I started to play Dead Redemption. I played it because I had a lot of fun on it, and then I got really good at it, and then I wanted to be the best at it, and that was like sort of. Pretty sure that's how every really top player starts. They love the game, they play it a lot, and, t and they get really good. But what I wanted to talk about is do you guys ever think that Rockstar Games competitive could sort of like blow up and we could have um, LAN competitions, like local area network competitions, where we go to venues and we play as teams and all this stuff? Because um, you guys probably don't know this about me, but I'm sort I guess you could say I'm a fan of Call of Duty esports. Like, um,. I did play a lot of Call of Duty Black Ops 2, this is when I sort of started watching COD Esports. Um, and I enjoyed watching it, I followed a few teams like Optic and shit like that and um, I watched it and you know it was fun to watch, I enjoyed it, I enjoyed sort of rooting for my team, as weird as it sounds because it is a video game but it is enjoyable and um, that scene sort of blew up in the last few years and um, they went from playing small tournaments for like basically really small amount of money to playing you know huge championships on a video game in which the winner of the tournament gets four hundred thousand dollars like that shit's crazy these guys live off doing this as a job now and um you know a few years ago they were the same as rockstar games is like you know there was a few little competitions but you know nothing big that could you know change your life if you were really good at the game so i really would be interested to know your guys opinions because obviously there's a lot of variables to Rockstar games that Call of Duty doesn't have. Um, and you know, GTA, I think, it's fair to say GTA 5 could never be a competitive game. There's a, As much as I enjoy this game, there is it's one of the shittest games, like, for bullshit. Like, out of every single Rockstar game I've ever played. Like, you encounter so much shit in this game <coughs> that completely fucks you over. And not ruins your time playing the game. But like you get shot through walls, the connection is horrible, it takes so long to load into a game. The crew system is messed up because you're not always on the same team as your crew. Like This game is a good game, but they didn't necessarily put as much thought into it as they could have. I think they were very lazy with the competitive of this game. Um, it's pretty good, you know, but other than that, other than it being pretty good, it's nothing special. And there could never be tournaments in it because there's no skill gap. There is really no skill gap. Like... We played UTL, the first ever match we played as a team with level 40s, we took a map off them. It was 1-1, and these are supposedly the best team in the game, and like there is really no skill gap because of the way the game's played. But as you can see guys, this video is kind of short, took a lot of editing. That's another thing with GTA, all the videos take a lot of editing because of how much bullshit there is in the game. But yeah, I got a pretty good score, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Leave me a comment telling me what you think about the competitive of Rockstar. What I wanted to say was... Leave a like, leave a comment, and peace out.